Grounding techniques can be very useful when we feel really distressed, particularly when the distress makes us feel very detached from where we are currently. Sometimes distress can be caused by thinking about things that have happened to us in the past, or we can find ourselves feeling anxious and worrying about the future. This is where grounding techniques can be really helpful as they aim to reconnect us to where we are here and now. This is often done by engaging our senses, so our brain refocuses on these things instead. One of the most popular examples of grounding techniques is the 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 grounding technique. First, you name five things you can see in the room with you right now or where you are right now. For example, a chair, painting, red car, carpet and trees. Then you name four things you can touch right now. For example, your feet on the floor, cool air on your skin, the jumper on your skin or your phone in your hands. Then you name three things you can hear right now. For example, people talking outside, your own breathing or the fridge humming. Then you name two things you can smell right now. For example, toast or perfume. And then you name one thing you can taste. This tends to be something that's a little bit trickier, but you might be eating a mint or you might have the taste of leftover toothpaste or cups of tea.